Hello there everyone, and welcome to my bow build. So, unlike the last two builds that I have showcased um, with this character, this does not have anything that reduces your HP over time, so that's nice, but let's go ahead and just get right on to the swing of things. So, we have six attack boost, five constitution, of course it's a must for bow as every single attack uses stamina, three crit boost, three wax, per usual, Three stun resistance, because again, that's nice. Stamina surge at level two. So, more recover, uh, more stamina recovery, the better. Two evadic sender, because I want to stay away from monsters as far as possible. We are squishy since we are a ranged build. So, more evasion is better. Two chain crit, because with bow, we're going to be very good at getting that up. Of course, bow charge plus, must have for bows. One point of normal wrap it up. For the we are using the fine Kimura bow and the first three levels are all rapid the last one is pierce so this is gonna help out not a whole lot but it is gonna help out a bit and the rest of this is just a little sugar on top so fiber was with punish free light resistance you know the whole shebang but to get into the equipment again this is the Fine Kimura Bow, level 4 and level 2 and level 2 Rampage, absolutely fantastic. 350 attack, base. Uh, the arrow levels that we have is, the first two are going to be 3 Rapid, and then level 3 is going to be Rapid level 5, and then 4 will be Pierce level 5. Which I actually kind of like a lot, because it gives us a lot more range, since Pierce has that. Asolus Helm, of course, this is probably my favorite helm in the game. Comes with, of course, Chain Crit. Stun resistance. Well, two levels of stun resistance, but I have one uh, another stun resistance in the level one, giving me three. Uh, uh, <coughs> my bad. I have a evade extender plus deco. Uh, I forget what it's actually called, but oh, I think it was jumping. But either way, level two evade extender, of course. In level two, we have crit boost. This time, I am going with the arch fiend chest. So, one point of wax, another point of uh, chain crit, nice. One point of resentment, which again, we're not going to be using a whole, whole lot. It's going to be nice. And a level three, put in normal wrap it up because that's going to help. Again, it won't help a whole lot, but it's just nice to have. And level two crit boost, or Malzano, uh, wire bug whisper, two attack, blight resistance, and two levels, of and a level two constitution deco. Absolutely great. Wrathless waste again. Uh, for the two attack it comes with, plus level th uh, level two decoration for that uh, we can get to level three attack boost, three wind proofs, and has one point of crit boost on it naturally. So it's great. Rekna Greaves, absolutely fantastic. So because they naturally have three constitution, three stamina surge, and with the two level ones, I put dragon resistance because. Or dragon resistance with this normally is absolute shit. It's like negative, it's around negative 10. So that was just great to have. And of course, the 2x level 1, which in this case I have flinch free this time instead of speed sharpening because that's not going to do us any good. So now, while this is curio crafted, I have no actual augments on it. It's just like curio craft ready, just because I wanted to see what you could do with it. That was really it. So then, on to the switch kills. So, charging sidestep. I did not personally use this in base game rise, but I have started using this in master rank, and I like it. I like it a lot. It, it's just great to have. You know, lots of mobility, and each dodge is going to increase our charge rate. So. It's great. So, it's just... How do I put this? I just like it. I guess that's the best way to put it. Uh, I actually forgot about this part. Um, so, the, I just have Power Shot. No more Power Shot equipped right now, but... One second. Sorry about that. Um, absolute power shot is going to cost a little more stamina, but it is going to add stun value. So if that is what you want. It's very, very great. Stake thrust, absolutely fun. It's amazing. 
basically we take a stake shove it into the monster this does replace our melee attack which to be fair we never really used and after we again shank the monster with the stake it's going to stay in the monster and then when we shoot it it's going to do additional damage so it's absolutely great just got to make sure that you can you don't have to pinpoint hit the stake itself but at least hit somewhere around the stake so it's not like pinpoint accuracy have to hit the stake aerial aim because aerial aim is just fantastic i love this now a note on butcher's bind i don't like this at all um so as it says that the second arrow is off talk <coughs> off target the large arrow disappears so it's very very pinpoint unlike the stake thrust so i am not the greatest aimer so personally i just don't use it and it comes with this Hercul i prefer herculean draw because it's just a flat attack boost and bolt bolt boost is nice but basically what this does is that it adds in a additional crit range for bonus damage so it's nice but i just prefer this because it's just going to be a flat uh damage attack increase for just no matter what range i'm at and they're i have both of them at the same because i'm not really going to be switching around a whole lot so then on that note on to the oh, no. let's see have Oh, that's pretty good. Cool. Probably should have <laughs> thought about this beforehand. Um, you know what? Give her seasoning basil bees. Oh, right. One last thing. Files. The fine Chroma bow can use everything. I think I noticed that. Uh, so, just whatever file you want, just use it. I prefer power, poison, paralysis, and sleep. Those are going to be my main ones. Uh, don't really need money, so... Wait a second, is he with Pyrorachna? Oh wait, no, she's right there, never mind. Probably grab Mag then. Ooh, that's a lot of fire cell.
one more. Okay, that's just... Have that. Oh, that is not what I wanted. Oh shit. As you can see, the stake. And there we go. One, two, three. Why did I put a bomb down? Nope. God. Yeah, I'll take him to the rack now.
Shit, I am nearly dead. Why am I going that way? Is that what I wanted to do? How did you miss that?
Oh no. Thirteen fifty four, I'll take it. Holy shit! Two mantles. What the fuck? Man, yeah, not been the best hunt, but those are definitely the best kind of rewards. you enjoyed or if you found this helpful please leave a like uh, really hope you did enjoy that if you have any ways to make the build stronger please leave a comment down below or new ideas leave a comment down below um, I will of course have more videos coming out later this week and into next week so sorry that's my train of thought so then, I hope you all stay stay tuned for what's next to come. Hope you all have a good day and happy hunting out there. <laughs>